All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms, and data structures beta. Learn basic string and array methods by building a music player. Step 47. All right. So inside the play next song function, we're going to create an if statement to check if the current song of user data is strictly equal to null. This will check if there's no current song playing in the user data object, all right? If the condition is true, we're going to call the play song function with the ID of the first song in the user data optional chaining songs array. That, pardon me, as an argument, all right. So we'll start off by making the if statement. And then we're going to check if user data optional chaining current song strictly equals null, all right? Then we'll have the curly braces. And inside here, if it's true, we're gonna call the play song function. And for the argument, we're gonna do user data optional chaining songs. And since it's the first uh, song in the array, we're gonna have the brackets with zero like that. And then since it's also the ID, we're gonna say dot ID like that. And then we'll cap off the uh, that little uh, function call with a semicolon. Check the code, looks good, and submit it. All right, now we're on to step 48, and we'll see you next time.